Hello world, welcome to wiki.mediamillion.com. In this quick screencast, we're gonna see how to install a local host. Let's, let me explain to you why we need it first. We need a server to run a server side application, be it PHP or ASP or anything. But it gets very, you know, time taking when we have to upload files every time to our server and check whether our code is working or not. So it is important to set up a local host in our own PC so that it works fine. And this is how you do it. This is where we get XAMPP. XAMPP is a product of ApacheFriends.org. This is their website. Go to their website and please download XAMPP from here. They have uh, XAMPP for various operating system exam for linux windows mac os and solaris i am running on windows so i am going to click on exam for windows link and please download the standard version over here uh, not light or add-ons or anything just click on here download it i've already downloaded it here it's in my desktop please install it by double clicking it once you install this is how the structure of exam looks once you go inside this is how the structure of exam looks uh, to see whether now we have to activate exam so that we can use it as our local host practically all you need to do is just install it and your local host is ready and to use it go to your start menu go to your exam link and click on exam control panel this is how your Excel exam control panel looks like and uh, here are various services that you have installed now by default these are all switched off and you need to start these services this is first is your necessary apache server this is mysql database if you are using wordpress or any database related uh, uh, coding you can uh, configure it in your uh, own mission and then use it so you need to start these both once you've started minimize it now open your browser to check whether all everything is in place you have to type local host and you need to get exam logo if you get this well everything is done proper and everything is in place if you notice here it says exam splash.php to make your files work for exam to detect your files you have to put them in a particular place and that is here it's called htdocs the folder is inside exam folder and it is htdocs this is where all your files have to be put yeah, basically the folders of your application if you see here it says exam and splash.php and you can actually see the folder here called exam and splash.php php script okay so in this example i'm just going to show you a wordpress uh, application which i have installed in my local pc and i have named it jdt if you see this is the wordpress wordpress structure i think you can recognize it it's here so let me access it now all you have to do is type localhost slash and the folder name jtt it basically detects your index.php file and starts running it so this is again uh, wiki milan installed in my local pc so this is how uh, you use exam um, thank you for sticking around in the next uh, screencast i will be teaching you how to create a mysql database locally and it is the same procedure that you will be doing in your near server side also so see ya